Well, hello, hello, hello. Welcome back. <laughs> so, um, well, I want to get a few things out of the way first. I made a few errors last week. I said that in the anime, Clay was voiced by Billy Comets, which was actually not true, even though I was told by someone he, he was. So, yeah. I'm sorry for that one. Also, he didn't actually um, pass away from um, COVID, but something else entirely. But yeah, it's still tragic nonetheless. Also, I want to apologize for something else, which is I accidentally put Charles as a jealousant on the tracker while he was actually, you know, still a frillish when we caught him and leveled him up. So, um, apologies for that bit. So, yeah. In any case, why don't we just get um, get to the game, eh? Because um, things have, you know, things have changed a little bit. Like I haven't needed to grind or anything, but things have happened. Uh, let, let's like let me just show you what I mean. So, as you can see, it is the team we've left off with, as usual. So with Aquas the Vaporeon, Buffy the um, what's this thing called again? Swana, Mitsurugi the um, Samurai, Bubbles the Azumarill, Mo the Golduck, and Charles the Jellicent. Uh, frillish, I meant frillish. Ah, I'm sorry. <laughs> I was just ranting about it, and I had the name Jellicent stuck in my head. Yeah, my item's alright, let's see. I'd say it all looks pretty good. Yeah. So, as we step out of the door now... Yeah, winter has started. It's now winter in-game. So... Yeah. Which means the encounters have kind of changes around a bit, which is going to be a board for when we get to Adala Bay, because we'll be able to catch this feel, which I'm considering adding to the team. On that note, I think Mo might be on its way out. So, sorry about that, Mo. Anyways, the plan right now is to get through Charged Stone Cave, as you might have um, noticed from the stream title. Also, if you get a joke, let me <laughs> props to you. And we, we plan to uh, defeat the Miss Tolton gym leader, um, what's her face? Kyla, the wallet. Kyla, her name is Kyla. Yeah. Also, this breed is named April, and um, guess which month it is? So, how are y'all doing, eh? I hope you're all doing fine. As for me, I'm fine, just had a busy week. Also, now the Deerling also looks different because it's winter. Because Deerling changes its appearance based on the season. I mean, nothing, of course, can't handle. There we go. You have the perfect trial. Uh, I might be too strong for you, I'm not sure how perfect it is. Oh, it's a Shelmet, which evolves into Exelgo, which I think is a really cool bug type. And if you disagree, well, that's okay actually. I just think Exelgo looks really cool. There we go. Down it goes. Right, next trainer. Ah, you've got a card form, don't you? So, everyone knows what the deal with card form is. It's its appearance change is based on the season. Which I always thought was pretty nifty.
What? Of course, reach level 1. Uh, level 37? Money water, um, I. Um. How much does it look of that? Just as much damage just as a chance of lowering accuracy. I might as well keep sand attack around for the guaranteed accuracy drop, to be honest. Also, Muddy Water's accuracy is not exactly pleasant looking. Well, let's have Charles lead for a moment. He's the new guy. So, only fair he gets to have his shot. I need to reset the EXP points of Pokemon for my homework because I'm... How do you do that? It's just, you know, it's just numbers. Mara. Oh dear. Okay, this is actually not a good matchup for Charles, so I'm going to switch him back out. <laughs> mm -hmm. Because here's the thing. Dealing is a normal cross type and ghost type moves don't do anything against cross types. So yeah, that sucks. And there's another Shelmet. Also what I like to call the um the crown of a um, of a smoking sometimes, as well as the shell helm of the Super Mario Maker too. There we go. Down it goes. And it has been defeated. Easy. Okay, you're not a Pokemon. No, you're a Fungus. Okay, Charles might be able to deal with this. Okay, that's not a lot of damage. Okay, Charles, buddy, you need to train up a little more. Okay, do you have any good counter? Yeah. Let's go with you, Mitsurugi. Oh dear, what do I do without my evasiveness? I really don't care. Okay, maybe it was a better idea to um, use Slash actually. Yeah, I'll switch to Slash. Yeah, that's better. Mr. Rugi has reached level 37. Excellent. Okay. So how's the team looking? Pretty good. Okay, I'm going to heal up uh, Charles real quick. And let's push onward. Oh dear, we're being attacked by a person in a lab coat. Okay, seriously, why does everyone on this road have a dealing? I mean, okay, there's that weather, that, that season institute research place thingy, so maybe that's why. In which case, I guess I already answered my own question. Oops! Oh yeah, scientist traders like to use X items for, um, on the first turn. Which are completely off limits in this run, because they are pretty overpowered. I, I tried to uh, limit my item usage to just one per battle. But X items are just banned entirely. And of course there's an exception made to, uh, you know, 
There's of course an exception made to Pokeballs, because if we could only use one ball to try and catch the Pokemon, that would not be very fun. Okay, do you have a dealing as well? Well, he's starting to sell that, but you have another Pokemon, so we'll just have to see. Right, use Bubble Beam. And another one. There we go. Charles has finally won his, own, his first battle. Took him long enough. No, you have a Carablast. Well, don't do I look the fool now. <laughs> so what was the point? And that was a critical hit. Oh my god, that was pathetic. Pathetic. Why people can able to understand the train? Maybe because they understand how English works. Or whatever language you speak. I mean, most humans seem to speak English. So that's what I sound like to you guys. Quiet in chat today. I sure do hope the chat is working though. <laughs> because, well, the thing is, I see the chat through OBS normally, so I don't actually have Twitch open. Not just for shits and giggles, I'm going to real quick open Twitch and see if... Um, yeah. Let's just say I'm a little bit paranoid. I'm going to check. Oh, sorry about that. Left the keybinds on. No, it really is quiet here. Hmm. Okay, no problem. I can just uh, continue playing. If... Ah! Route to watch it, remember. Let's continue tracking through it, eh? Oh, now I can turn my keyboard back on. There we go. And immediately I'm up against a pretty poor matchup for Charles once again. So let's switch. Well, Buffy is at least getting a lot of attention. That's a Carablast, so Daffy will be able to handle it as well. There we go. Again, there's a woman running around in circles. What the fun with Pokemon? I'm a dolphin, I always have fun with water. Well, usually, anyway. And it's another cast form. Oh, you're using hail, I see. Well, that's annoying.
happen. You're not Ember? Huh. Oh my, I lost. Yes, you did. Um, excuse me. Um, hello, Cabalion. Well, isn't that interesting? Oh, hello, Rude. That Pokemon. It's a legendary Pokemon called Cabalion. Yeah, it sure is. I told you the story the other day, right? Did you know? What noble presence? Say that the three Pokemon, Cobalion, Virgion, and Terrakion, fought against people to protect Pokemon from the war those people started. I see. In the field fight, there's no peace for Pokemon either. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, them being the swords of justice and all that. So why did it show up in front of people? Mm hmm. I think maybe it just trusts me, because I'm the protagonist, and legendaries tend to trust the protagonist. So Rachel gets his ambition and manages to go every wider and walk in the lives of all it touches. Yep. Yeah, I think it's a lot, actually. You don't have to be able to send much. But yeah, and it's special like that. He's truly gifted if he's able to understand Pokémon. Now, I wish I could be friends Cobalion and add him to my party, but um, not a water type. Oh, sweet. I can heal my Pokemon here. Hmm? Oh, a shiny stone. Nice. Yeah, evolution stones evolve your Pokémon. Who would have guessed? We're just about closing in on... Charge Stone Cave. Hmm, do I dare look around a little more? Yeah, I'm gonna risk it. I want to see if there's maybe a useful item or a TM to be found. Trainer there, I'd rather not fight them. Uh, yeah, it's a TM for fling. Pretty much useless, but oh well. I wanna look around a little bit. And there's a hidden grotto and a cave. Let's check out the hidden grotto first. Damp mulch. Pretty much useless, it's just, um, I think in this game it's just meant to be sold. Oh. It's one of these caves where it's just really flipping dark. And I don't have any Pokemon with Flash. And I'm not willing to teach it to any of them either. So let's just go. Right, here we are. And there's Bianca. Hello. Hey. Did you know this? If you push the floating stones, they move. Yes, I do know that. Yes. Lois displays is charged with lots of electricity that Pokemon like. The electric charge reacts from one stone to another, so that's why there are floating stones. I wonder if it would work like that in real life. You can't push all of them, though. 
Oh, that's right. Okay, we have to research something. We're seeing you. Uh, bye. That was kind of sudden. I guess you're literally just there to teach us about the floating stones you can push. This is what she's talking about. A full heal, well that'll be useful. Because I'm pretty sure we're bound to run into electric types. That's a Pharrell seed, not an electric type, but it's still an annoying threat to deal with. In fact, I would go as far as to say we don't have any good counters against this thing. So let it run. I kind of worried about the trainers because if any of them have a Thoros seed, we've got trouble. But let's try battling them anyway. Oh, super cool, acute member of your brand, huh? Okay, so what kind of cute thing do you have? Oh, it's Nimonga. Okay, fair. You win this round, I guess. Nimonga's alright. Not really something I would use personally, but I guess it exists. Oh, now you're using Electro Ball, I see. Yeah, the problem with Jellicent is it's spread... Oh, I did it again! No, not Jellicent. Prillish. The problem with Prillish is it's pretty flimsy. So, yeah. My bad. Oh, oh my god, I did it again, sorry. Okay, what were we? Okay, um... Okay, I'm over my frustration when it comes to, um... When it comes to Freelish and Jellicent. Etc. Seriously, how do I keep messing that up? Right, I think this is where we should go. It turns out the trainers in this area are quite tough, so I'm willing to just skip them. Uh, Jiltic, for some reason everyone loves this thing. I don't get it. So it's a spider. Boop. And it was a critical hit. Nice. Actually, do we have a revive? Because I would like to... I would love to revive, um, you know. It doesn't seem like we do. Well, isn't that just lovely? So, Charles, but you'll have to be sitting this one out. Oh, hello. Oh my gosh, one towel in front of it. Uh, yeah, not bad for this thing. Ah, look, it's a clink. Probably one of the weirdest Pokemon out of this generation. Because each evolution just... Because every time it evolves, it just gets an extra gear. And that's about it. I mean, then again, Generation 1 has stuff like Voltorb and Magnemite. And Magnemite are just three Magnemites stuck together. So if you're going to accuse uh, 
the uh, people behind Pokemon are running out of ideas. They've been running out of ideas since Generation 1, so, um, yeah. Okay, maybe I should have stuck with Fly because I uh, did a lot of damage last time. Oh well, we still made it anyway. Alright, let's let's heal Daffy up. There we go. Ah, uh, bridge, sure, an excellent place to uh, battle. No fear of falling down whatsoever, no sir. Here, have some bubbles. Um, I'll say it, as a concept, the gear grind is a pretty brutal Pokemon move. Because you literally, because you literally crush your target between two gears. That's kind of horrifying. Just don't okay, care. I really like it here. Formula has expressed the uh, forces behind electricity, the connection to Pokémon, and humans to everyone else. This, this is my ideal play. You're talking a bit quickly, my guy. Like the attack speed is higher than fast. Are you N? I have to go. I have to go in order to save Pokémon and protect the very friend I, that I have to stop. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure that it was N because he was talking faster than you, than normal people. Yes, I know I said normal people. N is not. N is special because he can understand Pokemon. Build a destructive force created by my free prize Pokemon. Well, you have a party of three, so that's interesting. But show me what you got, my guy. Corky. What kind of name is Corky? Oh, it's a triple battle. Interesting. Alright, let's give him what for, eh? Uh. Yeah. yeah, let's attack whoever the cross of Earth on you. That's quite a bit of damage for an unpheasant. Hmm. How strange. Oh, it is charged beam, that's why I thought this place was scary, because there's Pokemon like that in it. Oh, bloody hell. Uh, there goes Daffy. Um, instant regret of not buying any revives or checking if I was able to. Oh well. Let's bring Aquas out. It's not like he can do anything. And no, he can't. Because he's too far from the... Uh, from the rest of the... Uh, yeah. From the uh, remaining targets. Okay, the ball beam should finish it. And there we go. I 
Okay, don't you have yourself short, my guy? You took out one of my Pokemon, that has to count for something. Oh, hello. Hey, Grass Gem. These gem items are pretty good, actually. Although they never really return. There's a Pharaoh's Heat, I'm going to ignore that. Because Pharaoh's Heat is kinda scary with the Pokemon I've got. Like, I don't think I've got anything that... Like, I don't think I've got a matchup that works well against it. Oops. I wasn't supposed to push that. Okay, these wild Pokemon are starting to annoy me. I should still have some repels left, so I think I'll just use one. Alright, let's see. Well, let me reset the puzzle real quick, because... I think there's an item potentially behind those few stones. Push. Ah, there we go. It's a magnet. Probably not of use to me, because I don't really have any electric type moves. Hmm. I think I see a Dr. Serena over there, so if I defeat that one, I'll be able to heal my Pokémon. And then Charles and uh, Daffy are back in business, baby. Right, an Eraser Shell should take care of this one. There we go. Bit over this one. Yeah, easy. I'll become the wind and blow. Um Yeah, um you could do that just um you know. Don't uh don't get too cocky, you blow hard. <laughs> Oh, an iron. But the Pokemon even if I can't find a po oh, oh, okay. Um, <laughs> Yike. Yikes, my guy. Crikey. Who says that? Another pure cutter should take care of this solosis. And it sure did. Excellent. Mm, right. Alright, alright, alright. What am I doing? Why am I blanking like this right now? Okay, Uncle, no. I don't really see yours for that. Oh, look, it's a Gothita. It's... Well, let's be honest, Gothita is incredibly ugly. I got a lot of decks that uh, power built up. Okay, enough of, uh, enough of those jokes, okay? Like, don't joke about uh, attacking, uh, like... Like, well, let's go where I need it. Yeah, but what you are doing there is basically you have the tendency to beat a dead horse. <laughs> alright, alright. Okay, did any one of my party have any exp hold any XP share or nah? No. 
but I think I'll go and give the XP share to Charles if I still have it. And I do. Let it bubble up front for a moment. Let's play the twist to charge up my inspiration. How does that even work? Like, don't talk crap, lady. Oh, your name's Lumi. Well, I think Luna's a better name because you kind of sound like a lunatic. <laughs> oh, I just use Aqua Tail. Of course, that's when I decide to avoid it. And it was a critical wave. Nice. I'd say that more than made up for it. A gold bet. Interesting. Alright, use return. Oh, that didn't do much. A shame. I guess I'll just have to rely on, uh, you know, Aqua Tail. Okay, now it's uh, I can use, safely use return then. Well, uh, of course not, then it decides to hurt itself. Bubbles, if you love me, you don't hurt yourself. Oh sweet, that actually worked. I love 48. Nice. I made Libel Call in my head. Okay, and let's let's move away from this weird lady. I'll have Mo in the lead for a moment, although like I said, I suspect Mo might be on his way out. Hi Bianca. What? I'm here at Professor Juniper's request. Mm -hmm. I'm researching a Pokemon called Tynamo, but there aren't very many and they don't seem very strong. Yeah, but they they um, they have levitate and are pure electric type, so they don't really have a weakness. Which, which I have, to, which to be honest is pretty cool. Okay, do I have any different repels? Uh, would you look at that? I still have some lower tier ones that only work for 100 steps. Hey, my Pokemon, great! Look, look. Okay, I'll have a look. What you got, Mary? It's your two guy. Okay, yeah, that is pretty good. Nice, I like it. I like tier two guy. Tier two guy is nifty. It's just a shame I won't be able to have one in this run, unlike in uh, Pokemon Black. Because unfortunately, Neck Green City can't be accessed until the post game. Which sucks, to be honest. Well, down it goes. And Charles leveled up to level 37 and wants to learn Rain Dance. Not sure. I don't really know if there's anything here I would like to give up for Rain Dance. Maybe recover? What do you guys think? Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Nah. Confused me. Really. 
Yeah. Anyway, what do you get if when you combine a magma and a dratini? Well, um, you get a martini. <laughs> I could probably go for one of those. But I'm more of a whiskey type of guy. Arr. Yes, I also see R whenever something goes wrong. Well, we made it to Miss Tralton City, so that's nice. Alright, let's heal up our party. Nice. Okay, can we actually buy some revives? Because that would be pretty useful. And we can. Okay, let's buy like five or so. Yeah, that's nice and stocked up on supplies, so that's good. But now, now we'll have to go take on Skylar. I'm a little worried about Skylar. I probably shouldn't be, but I am. Oh, that's Professor Juniper. Hello. Hi there, Brad. Hi, Professor Juniper. It's nice to finally be able to talk to you in person. Uh, yeah, I suppose it is. I'm Professor Juniper. Yes, I just introduced you to the three things. You said the Pokédex came all the way out here with your partners. Yeah, I sure did. I've seen 85 Pokémon. Well, that's nifty. And we already get a Master Ball. <laughs> well, that's interesting. <laughs> The Master Ball is the most powerful kind of Pokeball. It can catch any Pokeball without fail. Yep. It sure can. Uh -huh. What do you mean by distribution? Press Juniper. Hey, who's that? Oh, Skyla, hello. Hi there, hello. Oh, I've been in Skyla. Yes, I just introduced you. Yes, she's a gym leader. Yes, yeah, yeah, I know. Why are you surprised? I did ask for a lift in my plane to cross Twitch Mountains since you can't reach up Lucid City by foot. Oh, that does sound annoying. <laughs> You're right. But I have a quick favor to ask first. Mm -hmm. I want to have a look at Celestial Tower, I see. We should always get along with all kinds of Pokemon. I decide, okay? Honestly, I can't tell if she's just laid back or if she's not paying attention to anything outside her head. The apple sure doesn't fall far from the tree. Um, yes, I am indeed coming to the gym to challenge you, yes. Alright, let's, uh, let's give it a go, eh? What could possibly go wrong? The battle might not say the Pokemon like Purloin. That's funny, Cyan's sister has a, had a, a third one stolen. Oh, you want to tell some people don't even have the badge here, alright. I didn't put the green houses around the runway, you ask? But as, so we can get some freshly picked vegetables as fast as possible. I see, and no, I don't need to use another repel. Thank you. Let's have a look around town and talk to people, see if they'll give us any items. A very fussy about Pokemon moves and extra fussy about technical machines. Yes, TM. How many have you collected? Twelve. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. My HP up, that's it. Huh. Weird. The sweet hearts who see through feeling checks is one way to get hard skills. I see. Anything in here? 
Here's the move right into. Yes, I know that, thank you. Mm -hmm. yeah, so I don't really bother with the medals. Oh, so many. So big. Hmm. I know someone who could make use of that. Leffy? I'm trying to give you something. I've got you a little gift. Ta da! Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to obtain any of those sweethearts because I don't exactly uh, have the means to uh, connect to other people anymore. Thanks, Nintendo. Mm -hmm. It's not like I've ever spoken to you. So yeah, that's true. Also, I think if you run down the ring, the runway, yeah, the cost fancy will ring. And it's Yancy. Hi, is it Brad? It sure is. That's your hobby, Brad. I see. That sounds kind of fun. Maybe I should take it up too. Oops, my colleague is calling me out to get back to work. Talk to you again. Goodbye. Uh, bye, Yancy. Oh, let's have a look around these greenhouses. There's... Yeah, I figured there would be an item here. Uh-huh. Okay, would you love some molds? I literally found some. Yeah, I have some damp molds. Would you just sniff it? Gross. Alright, the gym. So, let's head inside, shall we? Um. Ah! Ow. Oh, I'm sorry. I have to apologize by giving you this fresh water. Take it, please. Yeah, it seems like this gym violates every single OSHA compliance. So it sure is a good thing we picked OSHA water as our starter. <laughs> this gym is a wind tunnel. <laughs> There's no way this is safe. Like, the cannons were unsafe, but this? Because next time spinning quickly, you'll be blown away like a certain someone just was. Mm -hmm. You think the wind will blow stay here behind the wall and wait for it to stop? Okay, that sounds simple. Uh -huh. Yeah, I know about flying types, don't worry. I just don't have any good counters against them. Alright, I'm safe here. Sir, bet on me. Mm -hmm. Okay, I don't care about what the strength of a gym leader. Oh, your gym leader is. I just want to win, Mr. Flynn. Hey, that rhymes. Nice. All right. Deal with you. That straw bed is a bit of a piece of work, so. Okay, seeing as it used Skull Mind, I might want to use a physical move instead. And another one. Now I decided to use uh, Amnesia, probably go down a dark descent. <laughs> See what I did there. <laughs> well, to intend pressure come from you. Uh, that, well, that's impressive because none of them have the pressure ability. Out. Man, this gym blows. 
I know that pun was incredibly lame, but I'm not sorry. You. Battle me. Now. Pokemon stronger than the wind, it's my pride and joy. Oh, uh, I bet it is, yes. Wind's slow, so he's unable to win fast. Okay then. I'm at level 37, yikes, the levels are already climbing up. Okay, you decided to use Reflect, so it's a good thing I started using Surf. And you want to use Synchro Noise, and I'm actually not sure what that move does. Oh well. Let's take cover before we move on. <clears throat> and that's here. Uh... But ready for takeout. <laughs> okay, okay, I see. You're hungry. Alright then. An Arkan! Okay, nice. We finally have an advantage here. Go, Mo. Man, I love saying that. Easy. And Mo is with level 38. Wants to use Soak. Okay, so here's the deal with Soak. What it does is it changes the target's type to water, and that's it. It's pretty situational, and I'm not sh really sure when you would realistically use a move like that, to be honest. So I guess we can do without. Okay, what's going to do more damage? Strength or Surf? Surf apparently, hmm. Fortunately we are forced to land, I'm um, okay. Yeah, yada yada, you're just hungry because you said ready for takeout. Oh, don't you look the fool now. Sometimes you need to be bold, all the time you need to be careful. Uh huh. Honestly, though, it's usually better to be careful. For my experience, anyway. Lots of unpheasant. I wonder why. I mean, yes, they're flying types, but they are not exactly powerful. So annoying when the opponent decides to use Really? I hate seeing that. Right, you wasted 3 BP on, uh, on my Mo. You unpleasant unpleasant. <laughs> Okay, Charles has reached level 38, so that's nice. Okay. I kinda wanna put someone else in the lead for now. Okay, of course, you up. I mean, you're up. Just the thing you say, not the uh, continent. Run, 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 run. Oh, not good. Ooh, close one. Alright, blow me. 
Just came out as wrong. Okay, we need to be able to face the gym leader. Uh huh. You do guys everything that don't let you go down yet. I mean, it is true. If I defeat you, I will be able to face the gym leader. Oh, your name is Chase. Well, I guess that means you're on the case. <laughs> Thank you for that one, by the way. Suck <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's annoying we have to face a ducklet. <laughs> hmm. Okay, I'll switch to Daffy real quick, actually. If this is going to be the way you act. Hey, yeah, go ahead and use the roost. It's not like you're going, you're going to be healing much. Are you trying to spawn with a ducklet? I mean, it is built, I'll give you that, but um, that didn't last. Uh, another shoe bat. Alright. Uh, bubble beam. Okay, and another one. And that's all she wrote. And now Daffy's reached level 38. How could it be? I wasn't being careless at all. I mean, you were being cocky, not careless. Those are very different things, my guy. Right, let's have a little look at the party. Everyone except for Aqua is at level 38. Let's change that. Alright, let's give let's uh, increase uh, Aqua's level by one. There we go. And then I guess we'll heal up the party. There. Excellent. Alright, let's save. And then let's take on Skylar. Hopefully we'll be successful. Although I think some of the worst teams are out of the way now, because... Yeah, Elisa was definitely the biggest threat of the run so far. I've been waiting for you. You're a tough trainer who can face the wind and not get blown off your feet. I'm kinda excited about the battle, why don't you and I have some fun? Uh? Um, that's quite a bold thing to say, Skyler. I mean, hopefully this is going to be fun. For me. As in, I hopefully win this. Alright, Dig's not going to be doing it any good here. Well, let's just use Surf. Okay, there was a nice bit of damage, but I think it's going to, um, you know, be healed by Skylar. Yep, it is. Nice, critical hit. Oh, Swanna, that's, that's an annoying one, and it's at level 39. My team is hilariously actually on the levels by one level. That's funny. Oh, Feather Dance, that's a nasty one. And I won't be able to use Sand Attack on it either, because it's a Ground-type move. Right? I mean, it's a status move, I could give it a shot to see what will happen. Huh? Huh? That, that... Well, I'm frankly surprised it actually worked.
Fine, let's keep dropping. <laughs> In this case, let's keep dropping its accuracy. That's not a problem for me. <laughs> and of course, then the air slash hits. Sure. <laughs> okay, this is hilarious. I didn't think sand attack would work because it's a ground type move against uh, the flying type. But I guess it just does not it does not matter for um, yeah. It does not matter for status moves apparently. To be fair, hypnosis is a psychic type move and and it's not blocked by dark type uh, Pokemon so. Right, it's going to miss moves regularly now, so... And of course now he decided to, uh, decide to use um, Feather Dance and actually be successful. Well, that's just annoying. Oh, but it's a critical hit, nice. And out comes a Skarmory. Never give up to do so, it's an insult to the Pokemon that fights for you. I can completely see where you're coming from, yes. But, however, I can also use Feather Dance, and I'm pretty sure this thing is a physical uh, attacker, so... Oh, you're going to use agility, are you? Well, la da Okay, I'd say that's enough. Let's start attacking. Oh, and your speed goes down as well. Nice. Not that matters that much in my case, but oh well. What you gonna do? Okay, let's finish this. Ah, uh, well, there goes the awesome music. That's a shame. And there we go, we defeated Skylar. And Charles reached level 39. By doing absolutely nothing. Now we forget this battle like that, I could fight against you. Yeah, same, I will never forget how um, Sand Attack works against your flying types. <laughs> You're an amazing Pokemon trainer. The Pokemon and I are happy because for the first time in quite a while, about two years I say, we could fight with our full strength. This is an official League Gym badge, but this is just a stepping stone. Yeah, we've got our six bird. Yippee! What is one called again? The feather birds? The wing birds? The jet birds, okay. Wow, hot stuff. With that many gym birds, we'll come up to level 70 will be you. Not that it matters because none of them were received in trades. Also, why do you have this TM so that you always remember the spoken battle? Acrobatics, that's a pretty good move. It does more damage if uh, if your Pokemon is not holding anything. Hey Mr. Bottlenose. Hello, Yeroon. This was a right on plane. Okay, yeah, um, well I could use a plane right, that should get me to the next uh, to the next gym real quick. Whee! Can you wave? Yeah, look, I'm waving right now, see? I mean, it probably doesn't show in my PNG tube image, but yes, I am waving. Time for a quick hop in my plane. Where did Professor Juniper get to? Yeah, good question, Skylar. I d Wait, didn't she say she was going to Celestial Tower? Yeah, she's probably still there. But ask you to go with the Professor. I got to finish flight preparations at Miss Tolton Cargo Service. Right, you go do that and I'll go check on uh, Professor Juniper. After healing my party, of course. Hello, Mrs. Nurse. Heal my Pokemon real quickly. I'm busy with RS. Okay, nice. Still playing Necromancy? I mean, you probably are. Sometimes, yes. Okay, okay. Well, as you can see, I now have six badges. Ta da!
Oh, fun, you can play a little tune with him. Just like in Generation 4. Need some other levels? Yeah, fair. I don't think you say another word that's Pay attention! If they're still on the race walkway, you fall off. That's true, let's not stand still on it. In fact, let's just go around this. Hello, person, battle me, please. Okay, good, you also want to battle me, that's excellent. But no, I, I said six. I didn't say five or seven or eight. I wish it was eight. And I probably know what you actually mean, but let's not mention that. In... No, not a number. Yeah, I figured, but it's not something we're going to talk about in the chat. No, sir. Please, I for Sit down, please. Jeroen, sit down. Ah, uh, well, I can see this, uh, this doctor is going to be a nuisance. Let's switch to Daffy. Because this doctor is, be is being despicable. I'm already sitting egg. Uh, okay, good. You go sit on your egg, maybe it'll hatch. Oh, this battle's taking so long, the rain just stopped. There we go. A tranquil. Oh, come on, I. I just faced an unpleasant. This thing is nothing to me. It will hatch him. Uh, it will hatch him up. Uh, okay. Congrats on your uh, inner thumbs on your shiny Mimikyu, I guess. So, funny story, I always figured Mimikyu looked like a mob. I thought you played together, makes you really happy. Okay. Yeah, have you got any more? No, I train water types, and I don't want the Giga Live and Return either because I don't train rock types, so I train water types. I remember your first Mimikyu was shiny. Yeah, I'm really proud of it. She's actually in my copy of Pokemon Scarlet in the, at the moment. She still needs Mopina, which is a reference to Animal Crossing, for those who don't know. Oh, of course, what's worse than one bucklet? Two of the bastards. Okay, let's deal with this one real, real quick. Before I get the hernia from annoyance. Okay, you can stop air slashing poor Aquos. He did not deserve to be treated like that. Okay, that's the same attack, but... But our pheasant is not going to go down, is it? I think... I still think that Pokémon is rather unpleasant. <laughs> Okay, I made that joke already, actually. Oh, that still did quite a bit of damage for not very effective. <laughs> Yikes. You want to find this at home? Yeah, I'm the only one living in this apartment, although sometimes my shark boyfriend Jeff comes along and I'm considering getting a pet seal. It's going to be really fun once he comes along. Are you on yourself in... Uh, 
No. I... Okay, quick disclaimer everyone, I am acting in character on streams. I don't talk about IRL things on stream. But I think most of you know that I'm playing a character. Okay, back to in character now. Like I said, yeah, I can see we're getting a pet seal. More on that later. It could still be several months though. I think it'll be fun once that comes along. Okay, Chinchino, you don't need to start singing for me. My, my echolocation is rather sensitive. You don't need to slap me with a tail either. Let's... Please stop. Yikes, that was quite a bit of damage. Sorry, I mistook you for a... I mean, to be fair, I am a dolphin. So I guess I should not be too surprised. <laughs> there we go. About to seal up a bit. Um, let's have Mitsuru lead for a moment, why not? Uh What shock is so ugly? It also looks incredibly high. Like look at its eyes. I'm not sure what it smokes, but I don't want to know how you advise so um Okay, finish with if a bit of a revenge. Oh, yeah, Super Fang, it does that. Well, the Watchdog is down. A Leaf Stone. Unfortunately, I do not have a Lombre on my team, or I would have been able to use it on that. Oh, hello, Fungus. What's the faster way to level craft? Good question. Ask someone who, who knows more about Ruth Cave than me. Just um, the thing that's uh, the highest at your current level, probably. You are, are you? No, I'm not. There's people in my Ruth Cave planet that know more about the game than me. Thank you, Cyan. Oh, right, yeah, he is playing as Iron Man. I kind of forgot. <laughs> Sorry, you're good. That's a good thing uh, Mitsurugi fainted. Now I don't have to heal with poison. Boop. Let's miss Trollton Tower. Let's climb to the beast, shall we? A place of rest for innocent spirits. Yeah, they'd better be innocent. Otherwise, this could get a little bit scary. And I don't like scary, I like being cozy. In we go. Oh, there she is. Such a tower, it's a giant memorial. Yeah, I can see. I wonder if the building was built in a place of many ghosts and psychic type Pokemon, or if this Pokemon gathered here because it was built. Probably the latter, because there's many graves here. Inside of here, I mean. Oh, right, how are things with Skylar? I won! It was really easy. Apparently sand attack works against flying types. 
<laughs> Man, that was hilarious. I can't. <laughs> yeah, I did win the jet badge. <laughs> no, 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 I didn't just win it, just straight up ripped it from her hands. All the planes were ready to fly then. Just going to get me. They didn't think so. A lucky egg, nice. That'll help the grinding. At least, well, who am I kidding? I uh, found all the rare candies along the side of the road. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Police Officer, sir. Yeah, um, that's what I gave. Thanks, though. Right, let's go back to uh, Miss Trollton City. And now we'll go fly by plane. Yay! But first, let's heal up our party. There we go, let's look for Skylar. Where could she be? Is she in here? Ah, there she is, as well as Professor Juniper. Mm hmm, yes, she did. Yeah, I'm ready to uh, hop aboard. Hee <laughs> hee, ready for takeoff. Okay, Skylar, ready. Please take us to Lanthimus Town. I thought we were going to Opelousa City, but alright. Wait! You guys, wait, 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 wait! <laughs> I want to fly too! <laughs> I'll do some research and reverse the mountain. <laughs> Bianca, you're here. I thought to show the dedication of a serious researcher these days. Okay, everyone, off we go to Lanthimus Town. He <laughs> looks like everyone's here. What is this, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate? Finally, it's time to fly the Unova Skies. I think it's supposed to say Unova Skies, but alright. Off we go. So have any of you flown in a plane before? Because I sure have. We Again, Pokemon Scarlet or Violet could never. Oh, well, I suppose I should tell you why I brought you out here. Can't tell me that a group of people call themselves Team Plasma are planning to use legendary Pokemon to take over the universe region. Yeah, that's basically old hat. I knew that. As you may know, in the Unova region, there are two legendary dragon type Pokemon. Zekrom and Reshiram. But what about Kyurem? Two years ago, Zekrom and Reshiram each recognized the trainers as a hero, and they are following those trainers, so Team Plasma shouldn't be able to use the dragon type Pokemon. That's true, what could they be planning? There's much we don't know about Zekrom and Reshiram, and that's why I want to hear what Oblusa City's gym leader Draydon has to say about this. Um. His grandson isn't around, right? Because I don't want him to learn the uh, I I was knocked me off my throne. He drank that gym leader, so he might know something. Uh-huh. Okay, so why didn't you just take us to Oblucid City? I oh, I would like to help me if something happens. Sure. Maybe best not to get involved with Team Platform to start with. True. Mm-hmm. I'll be in the volcano just beyond here. Um, okay, take care of beyond there. It might be dangerous in there. A rare fire type, you say? That might be for an excellent opponent for my water types. I see it changes the scenery from the plane changes. Mm -hmm. Oh, hello. That has to be Yancey. Hello. Hi, is this Brad? It sure is. Really? So you like Pokemon Red type, Brad? Yeah, water types, they're amazing. You should try them. Many of them are cute, aren't they? Oh, hell yes. Oops, my colleague is calling me. I have to get back to work. Talk to you again. Goodbye. Yeah, goodbye. Item? Item. But it's a Firestone. No, not of any use to me. Right, let's have a little look see around time. Uh, around time. Around town, we might find something useful. Look, it's difficult. What will happen when you press select when you, when you are checking the town map? I don't know, because I don't have one. Uh, I thought everyone had a town map in this universe. What does happen, though? 
Ah, it's the zooming in and out button, okay. I did not know that. I'm still learning new things about this game to this day. Uh, gravity, why? What that would have been useful to know while I was fighting Skylar. And I'm also a teacher and I'm so obsessed with blue shards. Give me blue shards and I'll thank you for teaching your Pokemon they move. Okay, what moves do you uh, teach? Hmm. These are pretty interesting. But I have zero shards, so it's not like I can use any of them. Uh, of this. I'm on a journey. Do you know exactly why you're traveling? Yes, because I'm conquering every region with, you know, with water types. Uh, and the Croc Rock, hello! Right, it seems my Croc Rock percent run is also going really well. Spoke to me, you're quite a good trainer. Well, apparently, some people will just see you as a good trainer if you talk to them. I mean, sometimes raise you special. Yeah, that's true. I was born here and will die here. Um, okay. We don't know anywhere else. Mm -hmm. Okay, so apparently there's just uh, someone here has never left Lentimus Town, despite the fact that it didn't even exist two years ago. Oh, I like this route theme. It's pretty underrated. Hello, cyclist. Shit gears and you bobs your uncle. I don't think my uncle's name is Bob. Uh, I don't actually remember because I... I haven't really seen him in a while. Or since I was little, really. Anyway, it's another unpleasant, I mean unpleasant, so... And of course you didn't attack. Uh -huh. And it was a critical weight as well. Oh. Okay, stop using detect, it's getting annoying now. Oh, now you're just going to flip me off because I'm getting annoyed. Oh, that's rude. And Charles has reached level 40. Actually, the highest level party member in my, my party right now. Oh, and now he's going to evolve. Well, now I can actually change it into a Jalicent on the tracker after I accidentally put him um, on it like that uh, last week. <laughs> Right, let's do this. Uh, there is... There he is. There we go. Well, let's go past here first, before we press on. Oh, it's a Drift Blim. Nice. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, let's run from it. I don't really feel like battling it. And here we have a house. Yes. It has broken windows and shit. It's called a strange house, and it's a pretty creepy location, not gonna lie. Let's use repels because I don't feel like fighting those types at the moment. Wow, a lot of viewers today. Hmm. So, yeah, strange house. So the deal with this location is it's... Um, every time you enter and exit a room... Furniture rearranges, and you kind of have to figure out how to solve this maze. And as you can see, the furniture also moves a little bit idly. Uh, 
And this place is a fighting mess, ain't it? And I can't reach that item because there's a couch in the way. How annoying. Maybe I'll disappear if we go down this staircase. No. Interesting. Wait, the chair. Okay, let's, let's look around. There's just a person here, how interesting. This a visitor? Oh, I'm so happy to meet someone else here. Can I ask you to be a opponent on a long way to Pokemon Battle? How long have you been here and why are you in a haunted house? Like, what kind of pronunciation of haunted house was that? Man, I just can't talk today. Hmm. Alright, with Shrugi, you know what to do. Just um, raise the shower's ass. Down goes the normal. Uh, sit your left, I don't really have anything good again. Uh, again, sit your left, except for stab him. Oops. Oh, your defense went down, so how did that, is that a reflect working out for you, mate? Okay, what are you playing at? Are you just trying to stall? My guy. Why? Why Why do you have mirror move? Well, that's just a city of taking care of anyway. <laughs> oh, um, let me actually take that... Uh... But the EXP share of Charles now. Yeah. In fact, let's give it to Arcbos. I'm not actually sure what I'll be using the um, the Master Ball on though, because none of the, the uh, legendaries available to me are Water type, so it's not like I have any use for them. I might just use it on this field I'm planning to catch, just for shits and giggles. Trash can is empty. Okay, story checks out. It would be a really weird situation if the trash can wasn't empty. What are these round things anyway? Are they plant pots? Oh, hello, ghost girl. An everlasting dark dream, an endless dream of darkness. Dad, mom, Abra, where are you? No, they are not here. This place looks abandoned. What's in here? No, oh, an item. A bit of full heal. Down here, maybe? It seems like the friendships were rearranged and I might be able to get that item now. There we go. I wouldn't say this place is as creepy as the old chateau from uh, Diamond Pearl and Platinum, but it's still kind of eerie. Hello, ghost girl. In Dark Dream, I heard my dad's voice. Forget about the lunar wing, please stay here with me. Okay, so she was suffering from uh, one of Dark Rise Endless Nightmares, I see. That doesn't sound fun. And we find the lunar wing. Which, as you might know, is um, the way to attract Cresselia. Huh? Oh, the lunar wing. I can't take it now, but it'll be okay. Please return the wing to the Pokemon. I was waiting on the bridge so I could return it myself. Yeah, about that. She actually appears in 
black uh, in black and white, the original one. She can be found on the Marvelous Bridge, but she'll always disappear um, when you approach. Yeah, she's the same girl. She's a ghost. Apparently she passed away while being haunted by one of the Dark Rise Endless Nightmares, which is horrifying. Anyway, let's tackle Reversal Mountain. Like, I really have to say this, there is some really fucked up shit in Pokemon. That's one of the things I like about this series. Oh, it's a Pokemon. It's an Excadrill, drill, I kind of expect that, to be honest. Okay, Ray is also able to take care of it. Yeah, there we go. Nice. And that level meets already up to level 39. Also, we have Aqua some experience points. Let's put that here in front. Ah, Max Repel, how useful. I don't know what kind of Pokemon we'd encounter here, but I have Repel active, so not like it matters. Hello, Bianca. Uh -oh. oh, excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that. Hey, Brad. Uh, you know what? There's something I want to investigate here in Reversal Mountain. But the wild Pokemon here are really tough and having trouble with them. Can you come with me, please? Sure, I am using Repels. Oh, don't worry. I'll take care of healing our Pokemon, okay? Ready? Let's go. Yeah, I would like that, yes. No, reach a mind that predicts every move. You're a black belt, not a psychic. Oh, but it is a rotation battle, that's a little bit annoying. I think I might just get through it with, with uh, just flying type moves. There we go, there's one down. So you know, despite uh, despite the uh, over leveling, I am uh, I am getting to the point where it no longer matters. The level is starting to get a bit close to um, to my parties at this point. Also, dynamic points. That's that sucks. So close. Alright, let's uh, uh, switch uh, around my Pokemon and. Yeah, there. You should be using Charles, it's great at rotate. Oh my god! <laughs> 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 I had completely forgotten about that. <laughs> okay, okay. I, I, I gotta play this uh, this sounds real quick. Ah, uh, you know just what to say, don't you, Sawyer? <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, you might not be able to hear it properly because of the f uh, the, um, the filter on my mic, but I I'm laughing my ass off right now. <laughs> and I did want to talk to you, I want to see if there's an invisible item there. It's a nugget! But is it the chicken nugget? Because then I would eat it. There's two people here, can we do a multi-battle please? 
What are you there? Are you looking for the magma stone? The what now? Ooh, mountain! Okay, calm down, sir. But yeah, the magma stone, that's heat wrench thingy. Oh, would you look at that? We're doing a multi battle. And look, Gerda? More like her there, am I right? And that thing has dynamic points, because of course it does. I don't use fly, and let's not have it attack me. Oh, 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 nice going, Bianca. Damn. What do you mean the wild Pokemon are giving you trouble? Your Pokemon is uh, higher level than mine. Girl. Are you okay? Like, blink twice if you're not okay. Okay, so I want to get to, um... I want to get to, uh, uh Reversal Mountain as quickly as possible, because we only have four, like... We only have four weeks until uh, April is over, and then um, I won't be able to um, get this feel anymore. And that would be tragic. I say that as if we're in a massive rush. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I suddenly start to see why Bianca's struggling here. Look, Bianca, you could have avoided it at all if you just used Psychic and Golbat first. How would you look at that? It's another Daffy. Well done, girl, Bianca's Mishana. Yeah, it's Doubtland. Oh, that's impressive. And it doesn't intimidate, that's nice. I, I don't trust Bianca. She says she's not good at Pokemon battles, but... Um, she has pretty good coverage and all that kind of stuff, so... I think she's massively selling herself short. Mm-hmm. I see. Yes, I know about Stark Mountain and the Magma Stone, yes. What's this? Is this the exit? No, but apparently I missed an item behind uh, the strange house. Well, that's excellent. I'm not going back for that. <laughs> an escape rope. Nice. I'll probably never use it. And a smoke ball, nice, another thing I'll probably never use. Okay, let's not use the repel for a moment. I kinda wanna see what kind of stuff we'll encounter here. What can we encounter in the reversal in reversal mountain anyway? I mean I'm not expecting any water types, but uh, I am kinda curious. Oh, and oh dear, one of these things apparently is Horned Well, it sure is a good thing all of my Pokémon are higher level than those things. Oh sweet, Daffy avoids the rock slide. Well, that's just excellent. You well, know I'm going to check the first amount on both video real quick. No, no water types here at all. Why am I even surprised? That's a joke, I'm not surprised. 
Also, it play, it's playing the trainer victory theme for some reason instead of the wild battle victory theme. That's odd. Anyway, Akos has reached level 40 now, so let's take off this um, EXP share. And, um. Seeing as he's on his way out, why don't we have no leaves for a moment? Or she. Sorry, I can't help myself. Oh, Brad. Yeah, this is the place. Let's look around a little. Okay. Skorupi and the Woolworth, or Skorupi, however the hell you're supposed to pronounce it. Anyway, you surf, please. Oh, that was a critical hit against Mishana, but at least it wasn't a total wash. <laughs> oh, Bianca. Why do you sell yourself short like that? Oh, I'm not very good at Pokemon battles. I'm struggling with my wild Pokemon. Come on, girl, you're doing great. I feel like the writing doesn't always necessarily match to what's happening in the uh, battles. Okay, this guy will be able to heal our party as well, which is completely useless because Bianca heals our Pokémon anyway, but... Yeah. <coughs> Alright, Dr. Derek, is your last name Ogilvy by any chance? Easy. Not for positively blinding. Ugh, what is this? It's me. And now but you being healed by both Derek and Bianca. How nice. Okay, what's down here then? Oh? What did you find? Well this is place, it feels very strange. Could be the place where reverse mountain started from? The layer of the Pokemon Heat Ren? He turns the Pokemon with magma like blood flowing through it. Okay, so. I'll be honest, Bianca, I thought it was a native Pokemon to Sinnoh. So, what would it be doing here? Unless, of course, there's just multiple Heat Ren and they have different birthplaces. Which is completely and utterly possible, but. Oh look, it's a Grumpig. I know exactly one person who likes a Grumpig. And it's not myself. I mean, I suppose a Grumpig is kind of cute in a way. Although looking at it makes me feel kind of hungry. Alright, Mervy's level 39, getting very close to 40. Also, I just awkwardly realized that, um, that Mo is the only one in my party with strength. I sure hope this isn't going to get awkward whatsoever. Wait, is it the only one? TM69, nice. Okay, I, I am actually going to use another repel because I'm getting kind of fed up with these uh, wild encounters already. You know, nothing else in my party has strength, does it? No. Okay. Maybe I'll teach it to my uh, to my feel one. I'm inevitably going to catch. <laughs> I wonder what would happen if I had all three Pokemon attack at once. 
I'd say that he's cheating. Unless, of course, you're doing a triple battle. You, you have two mini Carsons. Oh my gosh, it's Cyan Heaven. Would you look at that? Like, look at that! Look at that! Look! Okay, why am I talking like that? This guy's based. Um, it's actually a girl, but oh, right. Yeah, but yes, she is. Most certainly. I'm sorry, Mitsuru Gear. I'm just going to have to take a few hits. Missed a lot of 50-50% chance. Uh, 50, 50 chance, I mean. Oops. Uh, yeah, true. Very much true. Where does Mini Carson just use? Oh, right, uh, copycat. Never mind, you may live. <laughs> I don't care what Akko's uses at this point. It's just single targets anyway, and so it's almost down. There we go. I could pick a target to focus on, however, you never let me pick one. Don't blame it on me. You're the incompetent one here, not me. Oh, what do you hold? A star piece, interesting. Imagine I have a Riolu still at level 47, why doesn't it love you yet? I think that says a lot about it, Serena, to be honest. Magical can't be used when you're someone with you. She can sit on the rear of the bicycle. Oh, a red shot, hello. Oh, would you look at that? I'm completely and utterly lost. Yay. Nah, I think we just have to go this way. Also, in white 2, this volcano is actually active and there's lava inside of water. But we are thankfully traveling to a much safer environment. Much more suited to um, us with our water types. Okay, this is a dead end. I guess we have to go to the right here. It sure is a good thing Bianca can speed walk like hell, eh? Knock you down with mountain power. Uh, um. If that means you're going to collapse this cave on us, then um, no, don't. Actually, don't. That sounds incredibly scary. Well, right, a hey, bulldog. That's nice to. Uh, that's nice for us to uh, face. Alright, that's just this. Ah, of course it's sturdy, but it doesn't... Boulder has a tendency to be sturdy. Another stuff should take care of both of these there. Well, probably anyway. The band is using trash, and I'm pretty sure that it does not let you pick a target. It's a 5 hit? Huh. Oh, color me impressed. And next good drill. I'll just use another server. Sorry, Bianca. It's a vibe that damn. Hey, Mianfu, um, Bianca, the rest of your party is evolved. Why is this stupid thing evolved? 
<laughs> and it was a critical hit even, like... Oh, well, most is level 40. Now if it's over the charts, huh? You think? Oh, right. If you say so. And more trainers, would you look at that? Yes, I have seen the point stones there, kinda hard to miss. Oh, this cave doesn't go too much farther. Because I still kinda wanna tackle some Pokestar Studios before the end of the stream. But I do hope to get through this cave. And maybe possibly catch a uh, feel. Which, if I recall correctly, is found in Andela Bay. Yes. 30% chance of surfing, that does sound like a like a good deal to me. Seems like I already took out uh, the two Pokemon of one of the opponents. I wasn't even paying attention because I was kind of looking up how, um, what feels odd were again. You know, as you do. Okay, then torture Bianca a little bit more. Sorry, Bianca. I'm being nasty to her, I shouldn't be. Okay, okay, I'll be nice. <laughs> I'll use an ad button <laughs> instead. Maybe I shouldn't have used an ad button. <laughs> Oh well. Now it doesn't matter anymore. Boop. My power of those, I was not aware of it. Mm -hmm. Alright, you were talking about the Lexites. Well, let's put Bubble in the lead. My party is looking nice though. Oh, and other times right through here. I want to keep looking around a bit more. So what What do you want to do? Should, should we say bye for now? Yes, we should. Right, you. good luck with your heat run research. I'm going to uh, go. And we're outside, I kinda want to save. God, I'm just glad to be out of this cave right now. Okay, can I just make a straight shot towards Andela Bay? Because if I can, I'll bloody take it. Mm -hmm. Start searching for it, develop Andela's resorts. Uh -huh. Oh, here's the where there used to be a mansion in black and white, but it's been demolished. Oh, and... This place is real fun, I can't wait till, uh, until we can, uh, can travel through there. Okay, Andela Bay? Andela Bay. Right, let's look for a sphere, shall we? Hmm. 
Let's surrender it another feel. I mean, it is a water type. It was one great ball. That's all I'm going to do. That's all I'm going to try on it. I'll heal more it, I'll say. Oh? You little tease. Oh, and now it's a little too fast for me to run from. I see. So you want to play that game? A Draco plate. Nifty. Unfortunately, I don't think they have any Pokemon with Dragon Titan. So well. Feel? No, you're a frillish. I have no use for a frillish. Already have a jealous sense. His name is Charles, and apparently he breaks hearts or something. Again, that says frillish. I don't need a frillish. Oh. Maybe in here? That's a whale, but that's not a frillish. Uh, I mean, it isn't a frillish, but it's also not a feel. Mm, yeah, no, I'm going to run from it. Apparently it does not want to let me run. I want to run, please. That's another Frillish, but I already have one. Had one, actually. Come on, give me that... ...feel. You see, because I accidentally referred to a feel as a Frillish earlier, I'm just finding Frillish now. Maybe if I say the opposite, it'll work. Okay, I really want the Frillish. Can I please have a Frillish? <laughs> it actually works. <laughs> okay, I'm going to keep a promise. Master Ball, go. There we go. We got ourselves a spiel, guys. This game is just confusing you. Yeah, indeed, it makes me go. Uh? They can't swim well yet, and they move much faster by rolling. When they're happy, they clap fins. Well, I know exactly what to call this thing, because he becomes a big and strong wall rush, so. I'll name him after Waza from Banjo Kazooie, that big purple wall rush. You know the one. So they'll give us some nice type variety. Right, um. Let's get this bad boy out of the PC, shall we? Right, Mo. It's been an absolute honor to have you on the team. But now I'd say it's... If you go in the house over there, there's a nice surprise for you. Good idea, let's. But first... Let's get Waza up to speed real quick, why not? Like, I mean like, few level or so. I mean, he's already evolving into a Celio, so that's nice. Celio is quite cute, I have to say. Spiel, I think, is kind of overrated. Wallrain would looks really cool, and I've never actually used a Wallrain on my team. Ever. Praise be to performance enhancing drugs. Yay! Oh, it doesn't evolve again um, at level 40, apparently. Huh. Interesting. Oh well, let's check out the, the interesting house. But first let's save, because we're finally out of the mountain, we finally have our newest party member. On that note, let me get to take care of the tracker real quick. Okay, tracker things, scrolling, scrolling. Okay, come on, what, why are you being fussy with me right now? 
It goes to 44. I see. Open it, please. Thank you. Oh, I had the stupid keybinds on while I was typing. I am so sorry. It seems to be a once a stream tradition that I keep forgetting to, you know, take it. <laughs> turn those off when I'm. Okay, so question. Can was learn strength? Can well. Although I think I kind of want to give it to Aquos. Although, what moves do you have? Uh, sand attack I could get rid of, but considering it works on flying types. Hmm. Okay, you know, it was funny, but I think <laughs> I think I'm just going to get rid of sand attack by now. Okay, at least we have something that can use strength, and that's the important part. Okay, let's heal. And let's go see the lovely lady in that one house, why don't we? Hello, miss. This villa belongs to Caitlyn, one of the Pokemon League's lead four. Yeah, indeed, that's true. It doesn't actually belong to you-know-who. Well, there you go. Are you satisfied now, Cyan? <laughs> okay, but if not, well, we're going to do some Pokestar Studios, so there you go. In fact, because it's Pokestar Studios, let's switch the text speed to mid. I see a nice old lady. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Cynthia doesn't actually appear until um, the post game. Yo, I wanna shoot a movie. <laughs> I think I made an exact same joke last time. Okay, um. Let's do. Time Gate Traveler 2 first. Why not? You look at the only one to perform it. The rental ones, of course. Because this is the first time I'm doing this particular movie. I uh, shoot extra Christina. Um, well, it's pretty flat chested for a female, but okay. I mean, it was uh, someone in Casey who played the Red Fog in those last movies. Let's never forget that uh, a lot of the weirder things are played by people in in full motion suits. Right, let's uh, take a look at the scripts. You protect yourself from attacks. Lying choose is important. Change your foe's ability. Pay attention to your Pokemon's HP. Withstand your foe's attack. Withstand your foe's attack. In other words, don't knock out the target this time. And don't get knocked out myself. I think you get a strange ending in this movie by actually knocking out your target. Okay, let's use Protect first. Good call, because it was using Focus Punch. Mickey Barb, eh? Hey, tell me what's going on here. I'm going on. Here's how things working. You lowly humans go into these human balls. And then you do as your trainer Pokemon commands. Well, humans won't go into the ball. We won't go into the balls until we dim it. It's uh, simple. What? In the world of future, Pokemon catch people? Future? I, I tell me that you've come from the past. Well. If you tell this Pokemon how to travel through time, you probably won't believe me. We're just a dirty lying human. Lying is cowardice. Ly cowardice is a crime. You must be eliminated. Eh. Uh, I'm not sure what the best option here is, but, uh... Hmm... Shall I just look this up, or...? Uh, 
Every time we talk sounds like a good neutral route. Let's go over that one. Can we talk? Talk? Why should we talk to a pathetic human like you? How ridiculous. Oh, that was a perfect line. Excellent. Okay, what was next? Now we have to change our foes ability. So, skill swap. Oh, yikes. All one's interesting acting, I see. Let's use rest, but I think Mark Punch is going to finish the uh, ocean. Uh, yeah, this this one failed. Let's try that again, shall we? No, let's not release this flop. No. Okay, let's try that again. From the top. Oh, let's speed through this a little bit. Okay, so first we had to protect ourselves. Okay, the, I kind of rushed through that one. Oops. My bad. Okay, one more time. Man, that was pathetic. Okay, protect, and then... Okay, now that just uh, set to normal heat. Sometimes it's not really a good idea to have your um, to have your perfectly legitimate DS speed up like that. Okay, can we talk? Because that was the perfect line we had to pick. Yep, that line was perfect. Going to change the foes ability. I'm going to use mark punch, but that's okay. Because it won't deal ridiculous damage this time around. Why isn't you Ocean holding a sticky bob anyway? Okay, let's look at grips. Pay attention to your Pokemon's HP. Mm -hmm. Yeah. At this point, I think I'm going to. It's Bob. I could either use rest or I could use protect. Hmm. I think I'm going to use protect first. Just to guarantee uh, one turn of not getting hit. Although this has, uh, although it does have a sticky barb, I kind of should have realized that. Hmm. Oh, and there was a critter. Okay. Sometimes. Sometimes it's it's kind of dependent on luck whether you uh, succeed at Boogie Star Studios or not. Okay, I'm going to give it one more shot and then I'm going to call it. It's a shame we weren't able to do two movies this time around, but oh well. Sometimes it just be how we do. As Cyan would say. From the top. So I think turn one, protect, turn two, skill swap, and then just rest. That seems like a good game plan. It just taunts this time? Hmm.
Okay, that's why we were. Your swap, please. So, isn't Sticky Bob supposed to go to the other side if, it, uh, if an attack hits? Am I missing something here? Okay, now that's a user rest. There we go, that fully heals us. So that's nice. And then it's going to pick protect. I mean, it should stay asleep for both turns, but... That was a critical hit. Okay, I think I'm in crit range at the moment, that's annoying. Alright, if I survive this turn, then we'll succeed. Okay, good. And cut. Better than normal, you say. Hmm. I guess even this director needs to take a bit of a break from being mediocre sometimes. Okay, let's watch our movie and then we're going to call it. Yes, I am interested. Let's go watch our weird um, Planet of the Pokemon movie. As I'm going to call it. <laughs> there it is. Time Gates Traveler 2. Let's go watch. Time Traveler 2, Pokemon Planet. Yeah, it really is a ripoff of Planet of the Apes, isn't it? Planet the Red Rod is only venture the temple transport into the future. As you collect soil and stones from the future as research samples, an unimaginable resident of this future world stood right behind him. I do like the little carablock with the backpack, that's adorable. It's a Ladian. And sent, uh, sent out the black belt. That's interesting. Stop right there, human. A Pokemon? And not often that we get wild humans showing up in town. They are dangerous and need to be eliminated quickly. A talking Pokemon? Did it just release a person from that ball? What's going on here? It's like everything is backwards. Huh? Humans using Pokemon? What is this madness? Could this be... Is this the future? Hmm, what's this? You're a strange looking human. You look kind of like a scientist, but I've never seen your type. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So there's just scientist type humans out there to catch, I see. What's the battle for you with the little hand back on the top right? <laughs> They're all box types though. Hmm. Wait, tell me what's going on here. What's going on? Here's how things work here. You lowly humans go into these human balls, and then you do as your trainer Pokemon commands. All humans who won't go into the balls are to be eliminated. It's simple. What? In the world of the future? Pokemon pets people? The future? Are you trying to tell me that you come from the past? Well, should I tell this Pokemon about how I travel through time? It probably won't believe me. Or are you just a dirty lying human? Lying is cowardice. Cowardice is a crime. You must be eliminated. Can we talk? Talk? Why should a Pokemon talk to a pathetic human like you? How ridiculous. It's a person. I better try not to do too much damage.
You, human who use Pokemon, you understand me? You can speak? Stuck in bull, treated like a thing. Not talk ever, not talk good, but must talk you. You say you from past, I believe. Thank you, I appreciate it. Long ago, rock Pokemon gets strong, evolution still makes strong. They take over. Eliminate many human. What? What's an evolution stone? Evolution stone make bug Pokemon very smart. Pokemon strong and smart. No chance for human. Never imagined the future could be like this. Black belt, silence. Stop yapping with an orange human. You're nothing more than a tool. Do I say or face the consequences? The dumb human is holding back, he doesn't want to hurt another of its own kind. Hmm, such a common traitor among the weaker species, how foolish. That's, uh, them's fighting words, Larian. Are you telling me you don't care? You wouldn't mind hurting another Pokemon? How could you obey a human like that? Such a disgraceful Pokemon. I'll eliminate you all. to defeat people you're controlling to protect my Pokemon. That's enough talk from you. Is that the scientist ability running your mouth? <laughs> oh damn. <laughs> burn. You better have a burn heal, am I right? How did you do that? You protected your Pokemon without hurting my black belts. Hmm. Interesting, you are an unusual human. Okay, I'll spare you from elimination. I also believe your wild story. But first... Still, let me catch you. No, what's this? Some kind of string? Get it off me, untie this string now, let me go. Ah, the more I try to break free, the more stuck I get. Powerful sticky string of a bug type Pokemon. Please, I don't mean to harm any of you. You've had your fun. I don't want to get back to my own time. I think so. Unfortunately for you, I'll be the judge of when I've had my fun. What more do you want from me? Hehehe. <laughs> we couldn't make a time machine with our own technology. But if I could get my appendages on this human's time machine, I'd be a hero. Come on, say something. Okay then. If I can capture humans from all the different eras of the bug type Pokemon, we'll prosper even more. Stop, get away from my back. What's all this junk? Dirt and rocks, plant seeds. It's just a bunch of garbage. Mm, what's this? Looks like a human ball. Something's different though. I got it, could this be... Oh no, not the temporal transport. Bingo, so this is your time machine. Temporal transport, you called it. Impressive to have fitted into a capsule this small. So lady captured me and seized my temporal transport. However, I would not give up so easily, not when I was still had to deliver these precious research samples back. To my own time. I had to keep fighting. And that's the end of that. That took a while. Jeez, I'm like 20 minutes over time. <laughs> oh well, I'm really going to wrap up now, after talking to the fans, of course. Okay, give me your items, please. Let me set the speed back on too fast. Okay, the girl on the left usually doesn't seem to give any items, so... Oh, 
I just go talk to the NPCs that are scattered around elsewhere. Like you, you have an item, right? No, you don't. Hello. Okay, it was a hit, excellent. So how much did it make? Sixty one point six billion, alright. That sounds nice. Right, I'm just going to fly myself back to Andela Town and then I'm going to call it. Because we are getting kind of... Yeah, we are kind of stretching it out at the moment. No thanks to me completely messing up the movie a few times. Well, just go to save and then I'm going to do my outro. Okay, excellent. Well, with that all taken care of, uh, we did a lot today. We caught that feel I was hoping to catch, and we also beat Skyla, something like that. And we made our way to Judge Stone Cave in in the opposite order of that all. So yeah, next time I guess it's making our way towards Opelucid City, I think. And hopefully, don't run into great and then. Have, uh, I risk having him call me X champion. But uh, yeah. Well, that's it for this week. So I'll be seeing you on Saturday next week if everything goes according to plan. Now get out of my house and I'll see you all next time.